That's why when you see things going on in people's life, amen, praise God, listen to God. Because sometimes you're getting in the way. You're messing up God's plans. Huh? Amen. A person going through something, praise God, that might be his ministry. Hmm? And you think it's so bad. You need to stop your head hard. Mother can't tell you nothing. Hmm? And if you listen to the Holy Spirit, say, I got it. I got it. I got it. I know you don't like what you see, but I got it. Hmm? In the midst of all that, yeah. Some folks say they've been doing things with drugs and alcohol you thought should have been dead. And God so kept it. In the midst of all that, God I had him. Huh? God had him. Yes. Now, his choice was to do what he did. Willfully mm -hmm. or unwillfully. Mm -hmm. That's what he chose to do. Jesus ain't going to pour himself on you now. That's right. mm -hmm. He ain't going to try to make you stop doing nothing. Yeah. Huh? You got them. You got to make a decision. Sure huh? You got to make a decision. Yes. God, I'm tired. God, I'm tired. I need to give my life to you. And He said, "I'll be right there with you." I've been waiting. Come on, come on. I gotta go for you, man. You done, you done five years behind. Come on now. You gotta catch up. I gotta get you busy, baby. I gotta get you ready, baby. God, and prepare to send you on out there. Right. Well, only God can do it. Amen. But you gotta give God. We got to give God that control. We got to give Him that control. What are you going through this morning that you feel like giving up? What are you going through this morning and you're questioning God? God, why God? Why God? You know, I'm living good, I'm living right, I'm doing the right thing, but why are these bad things happening to me? You're a good God. Why are you allowing these things to happen to me? Let me tell you something, okay? God is involved in your life whether it's good or bad. If you are born again, believer, I don't care whether it's good or bad, God is involved in your life. Stand to your feet. Stand to your feet. All things work together for the good. All right. Now, if you don't love Him now, hook up, hook, get yourself hook up. Get yourself hook up. Because maybe. What you are going through is because you don't love God. You just refuse to do what you need to do, and you're going through. Amen. Some people are some people is questioning themselves. God, why am I going through all this, God? And but if you stop and check yourself, Amen, brother God, you will find you will find more than one reason why you in, why you're going through it. You're disobedient. You're not listening to what I'm telling you, and you're doing nothing I'm telling you to do. But you expect me to shower you with all your desires. You expect me to shower you with all your desires and living the way you live it. Huh? Amen. You got to live, amen. Huh? The Bible said it's obedience. It's obedience. God, I'll be right there, praise God, sitting there watching you. But until you start listening, amen, praise God. Amen. You start listening, then God start moving. It's like, it's like a truck or a car. You can crank them up and praise God and you can sit right in the yard. If nothing will move until you do what? Put them in gear. You gotta put yourself in gear. Come to God. And when you do that, amen, and you stop moving. If not, praise God, you'll be running, but it ain't going nowhere. Huh? Man, if you praise God, you're coming to church, amen, but you ain't going nowhere. Huh? Amen. Because you ain't being obedient. You ain't being obedient. You're coming to church every Sunday, but you ain't being obedient. It's a thing to do. Uh, but don't you know, brother, God, our good ain't going to get us in. I don't care all the good you do. ain't going to get you in. If I was accept, we'd be born again. Born again. Uh, born again. Except uh, we'd be born again. Uh, we ain't going to heaven. Ain't nothing going to heaven, praise God, but what, what, what came from you. Jesus said, I'm going away. Well, I'm away, praise God. I'm going, I'm going to send back something going to keep you until I come back for you. Yeah. If you ain't got the Holy Ghost, you ain't going nowhere. Nah, that is like you hanging around the train station, but you ain't got your ticket. Hmm? You won't go to Chicago, praise God, but you just refuse to pay for a ticket to go to Chicago. A lot of you talking about heaven, but refuse to do what's right to go to heaven. Nah, you're hanging around the church, amen, but you ain't doing the right thing. Nah, and then yet, you expect to go to heaven. It ain't going to work that way. Stand right where you are. I want to be eye closed. Amen. I want to be eye closed. I want to be eye closed. Listen to me, y'all. Somebody needed to be encouraged. Somebody going through some things. Amen. Amen. 
Now I've got a money. Huh? And God, 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 listen, God came this morning to encourage you. Huh? Don't give up, amen, because you're going through. Hmm? Huh? There's so many reasons why God is taking you through what he's taking you. Huh? Amen. Maybe praise God, amen, praise God. God will see where he's going to take you. He's going to take your ministry to another level. Amen. Maybe God, see, praise God, amen, praise God. May your life, amen, praise God, need to take a turn. But God knows it. He knows you better than you know yourself. But you got to believe that now. Quit taking matters into your own hand and just trust God to fix it. Huh? No matter how long it takes him to do it, he'll keep you until he fix it. Huh? Amen. You ever notice, amen, when you call that CG? You know, they, they, they just don't say, um, we're not supposed to speak to you in a minute. Just hold on. While you holding, S C G, amen, got something going on to keep you to hold on. Am I right? If they don't say nothing, you hang the phone up. But they have somebody talking about S C G, the price about something, what you can do to better this or better that, and that keeps you holding. But if they don't say nothing, man, I'm tired. Ain't nobody, ain't nobody on this line. I'm going to hang up. And that's where some of you at. God is keeping you. Mm, until he get to you. He's keeping you. Huh? He's keeping you until he get to you. And if you can be patient, he'll get to you. Now, Heavenly Father, amen, as these heads are bowed in this place on the day. God, we give you thanks, amen. Uh, there are many of us, amen, that are going through some things, amen. Somebody, praise God, on the verge of just in your spirit, amen, praise God, you're tired. You feel like just throw your hand in. That's where you're at. Oh, Hallelujah. God, I know God's speaking this morning. He's speaking this morning. I feel it. I'm always. His spirit is in this place. Somebody's tired. Huh? Why me, God? Huh? You're questioning him. Why me, God? Why not you? Huh? For what I, for what I, for what I'm preparing you for, I need to take you through this. Hmm? You might not like it. You might not feel you deserve it. But God is saying, Amen. It's for your good. God, at this morning, at these head bows, amen. I ask that you encourage the heart of that person right now. Are, the, are those people, amen, that are in this place this morning? Uh, amen. Who are going through some tough times, amen. And, and the only heard, amen, of asking the question, God, why are you allowing so bad things to happen to me, God, when I love you? Uh, that's why he allowed it, amen, because you love him. And because you love him, he'll keep you in the midst of it, and he'll bring you out of it, amen. But you got to trust me. And God, this morning, praise God, I ask that you look upon your people right now. We thank you, amen, for those, amen, that came in late. Amen, for those that are not here this morning. For those that are home, praise God, tormenting themselves, amen, praise God, about a situation, about a problem, praise God. I ask right now, God, that you go into those homes, amen, and encourage them, God. Let them know that, praise God, you got all things in control. No, Shandala, hallelujah. God said, I got them all, I got all things in control. I see what you're going through. I feel what you're going through. All I need you to do, praise God, is trust me this morning. I'm going to bring you up. I'm going to bring you up. And God, I thank you, God. Right now. In Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. Come on, lift your hand and give the Lord some praise tonight. Amen.
your hands are taken away as God ain't going to get no better. But it's what God put in that heart. What God is saying to your heart that when you go to sleep. What he's putting in your heart when you come and pray, when you read your word at night. Just trust me. Just hold on. Just hold on. He said, what you're going through, you can deal with it. I ain't going to put no more on you than you can be. Whatever you're going through this morning, you can be. In Jesus' name. Hallelujah. I thank God, amen. Praise God for you this morning. Praise God, amen. Praise God. I pray, 